Good evening everybody, it's uh, race two here at Zolder from just an average sim racer, Liam Kev. And uh, join me for the next half an hour for shenanigans at Zolder, which is the track we are at. I'm going to race everyone to see in the half, t uh, half nine race. Yep, half nine. Um, which yeah, was my first race in a couple of nights, so I was a bit rusty and I showed <laughs> it was rusty. Um, Finished starting night, finished tenth. I think it was. Um, lost a couple of our rating points. Lost some safety rating. Just some carelessness and observant stuff for myself. But I think it was observant. Get a bit of a fifty to us. However, we are back. Um, yeah, it was older. We've got a slightly strong strength of field, one point one k. Um, in this one, so I'm actually one of the lower qualified drivers. Um, yeah. So the pace could be quick. Which will make things very interesting. Um, so it's important to just do my own thing, keep out of trouble, um, and just drive safely. I think that's probably the best thing to do. Um, so we're all good to go. Um, which one levels all good, all good. Uh, the return of the third camera, sorry, the second camera, off to my right, to the new people, um, is back. Um, I think now I'm going to a slightly dodgy cable. Um, I was using a cheap cable that came up on the bike lights. Uh, last year, so um, yeah, don't think you liked it for some reason. Different angle what normally is, there's only a bit more behind me, but put it to the side. Um, so you've got the front one to the left, I mean, one with the, the, the YouTube camera. Um, the YouTube, <laughs> don't know why that voice, oh well. Uh, and then obviously the little GoPro esque, fake GoPro, it's not a GoPro, it's a fake GoPro from 7dayshop.com. About 20 pounds. Uh, I do have a second one somewhere else in the house, no idea where, but it's around. But good thing I can mount them just about anywhere. So, once I sort of cabling out the power for it, um, it'll live up there. Hello, the second viewer, welcome to the stream. Um, we are. Bum, 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 bum. Let's get qualified underway. That's the most important thing. Let's get some grid position going. Condition on. Engine start. Right, Every screen is ready on this question. The pit exit's clear. We've got two laps to get the job done. I want to find a from a very rusty lap in the last race. Very, very rusty. Classified curves, they really do unsettle the car. That's fast left hander. Much curving on the inside of the two corners. That second chicane. Well saved, eh, Kev? See what I wanted to rip out my hands on. Like the shaving. Different lines, I think you can take there. I think people do take different lines as well. Should I reckon if I can take this? Oh. Here we go. Start of the first flying qualifying lap. Here it's Circuit Zolder. How not to take that first corner. That was actually it was a great example of how not to do it. Nice and smooth for about first chicane. If I say so myself. Just 
so easy to last the rear was only on that exit there because you're in such a low speed kind of gear. So far, a tidy lap, nothing spectacular. A bit late on the brakes over normal. Start the next flying lap. Come on. 130.75. B12, that was a 130.08. Oh, nice free wear. B12. Behind has just done a 30.87. See, that was terrible. So, 12 places, there's some fast guys in this race. That was nice and smooth again. I thought this would look quicker than a 130. I think a 128 super night, I must have been on fire. <laughs> it's a bit airy on the gas there. Too early, wasn't it? Really? Never mind. Twenty nine eight seven nine. You're currently two point five seconds off the pace. Quick guys, I suppose. But I know I could have gone quicker. I don't know. Maybe there's a bit more practice needed, maybe because I've not practiced since Monday night. Makes a difference, I think. Qualify there. Let's have a quick look. Uh, it's 12th place, way down where I want to be. Um, I know I can do quicker, uh, but look at the pace that split. split. Uh, yeah, I'm looking around 8th or 9th, really, uh, for my ideal pace. Um, you know, it's one of those things. So let's make camera just reset again there. Pff, I need to work out what I was doing that in uh, Magic Lantern. That's an idea. As you can see in the stream watchers in this video, slightly different layout of everything. Move the microphone over to the right, keep, make it a bit cleaner on the video, uh, which means you see my ugly mug a little bit more. And the kid doesn't play a bit of often. I have a treasure trove in this, this room, but she loves to play with everything. Touch things, it's what free roll, most free rolls do. Um, certainly keep you on your toes. Do, do, do. Just waiting for the race to get over five seconds to a grid formation. Um, uh, I'm going to just out of trouble. I mean, that, that's the end of the session. I, that's the sensible thing to do is just to stay out of the way. <coughs> oh, excuse me. If I finish where I am, I will be in eighth place. Uh, lose eight I rating points. So I need to get at least to ninth. Top ten would be handy. I think I'll probably gain a bit more than that. So I need to be about. Uh, Around here. That's where we need to finish. I need to be aimed at ninth place for me. I think that's just sensible. Uh, right then. Let's click on there. Click on there. Engine start. Got to be careful not starting that effectively. Oh, what have we got? We've still got about a minute till we go. Uh, pace car lap. 
So I've got a couple of videos coming up which I'm working on. Uh, I need to do the voiceovers for them um, in the coming days, probably tomorrow I'll do that. Um, which are videos, recap videos, race win videos. Everyone always posts their wins, blah blah blah. But this one's a time. It, it, those were ones. One was my first ever winning the BMW Championship, which uh, I don't think I streamed it. No, I really didn't. And the second one is another win from this track, Zolder, from um, Tuesday night, uh, which was offline. Uh, I didn't stream it, didn't record it, I just raced online. Uh, no distractions, no trying to talk and be racing at the same time, which is an art form which I don't, certainly don't have. This is why I'm yawning. I can't hold me on to it. It is. Tempest 26. to 10. In at night in the UK, it is bedtime almost as my phone will tell me soon. In the right column. I'm going to get the pace lap underway. On the left hand side, which is where I'd seem to be starting all week. We're playing on this track, I'm scared. It's a nice easy track actually man, when you get into the rhythm it's alright. Yeah, okay. I'll give it a shot. She's got some good safety ratings out there so I think the other drivers will give a nice, nice amount of room as well. I reckon. <laughs> Hopefully. I'm just going to hang in the back and watch you guys. Sounds sensible to me. It's always nice when you get new guys. It's a bit of a slow pace, this feels like. Kind of right me. That was a bit interesting. Sorry. 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 Catch up to car number two. <laughs> I thought you were going to go right to the back of that car in front of me, mate. Right, I hate starting on this chicane. Go, go, go! Okay, here we go. Blue flag. Whoops, someone's gone off already. Freebie. There's an incident here. Turn one. A snail position through there. A little good drive off the corner. Right side. Still there. Clear right. Yellow flag, keep your wits about you, mate. 
incident in the head. Spin off to the right there. And get on the gas too soon, probably. Ooh. I was twitchy on the curve at the front there. I'm taking that corner a bit sharper than I was in practice. Tenth position. Never near the apex, but mint. Okay, Kev, ten minutes to go. That's ten minutes left. Is now 1.2. A lot of cars in front of me. The map Malone would say it's a gaggle. Ooh, spinners. Clear left. There's an incident in the second chicane. I managed to dodge that one, but I did. The leader has just done a 128.00. It's a fast lap for the leader, that is a 128.00. Eighth place. Your lap time was 130.87. Exits. Thank you, Jimmy Boy. Jimmy's my crew chief. Loves to be a bit sweary sometimes. That's probably the best thing I've ever taken that corner. Guy, my mirror is giving me some nice pressure. We're all at very similar paces as a lot here, which is nice. There's an incident in turn three. Yellow. Oh, hello. Car on the roof. Someone's doing a turtle. Oh. Turn three on his roof on the apex. There's an incident in the first chicane. It looks like Rodriguez. Car right. Hold your line. Still there. Clear right. Nice driving, mate. Right side. Clear right. Car right. Clear right. Incident in the hairpin. On your left. Hold your line. Hold your line. Still there. Clear left. Car left. Hold your line. Still there. Yeah, I'm still here, mate. Car's still there. Hold your line. 
Hold your line. Clear left. Halfway home. Fuel's good. E10. I don't know if he punted me off or not, wet. I'm not really too sure. Okay, let's just keep it simple. Whoa, it's okay. A bit of time to go behind me. I don't know clear it from there. Five minutes to go, five minutes left. I did lock up into the heaven, it wasn't my finest bit of cornering. One twenty nine three eight seven was my best lap, it was pretty good. I'm hoping that these guys get into a battle. Slow them down. Fastest lap for Rodriguez, 127.74. Yellow flag, keep your wits about you, mate. Yeah, incident in turn one. We think it might be Rodriguez. You need to push if we're going to hold this position. Lift slightly a switch, we call it unsettled in a chicane. Okay, we're all at very similar paces here, aren't we? Flash, give him a flash there, lads. Why not? The gap in front is now 1.8 seconds. E9. Oh, nice. On for a nice clean race if that guy had put it on the back side, to be honest. We think P3's gone off in Turlemen Bucked. Just two minutes left, two minutes to go. Come on. Yellow flag, caution. Giving it some up ahead there. Not bad. <laughs> Lost a lot of time there. And everyone's getting bunched up here, which is nice. Get two tenths off the pace in sector one. Sector two is 1.1 seconds off the pace. Sector three is 1.5 off the pace. New fastest lap for Rodriguez, 127.53. So Rodriguez is quick, but doesn't seem to have consistency. What have we got? So 
Probably be a white flag lap in a minute. Oh, nice. You know when you nail it, it feels smooth, that was it. There's a lot of cars up here. Ooh. What the hell? He's all over the place. This Marco guy's all over the place. White flag club. Last lap. You've just done a one thirty one two two. Oh man! Jesus Christ! That wasn't even my fault. Come on, Kev. Good stuff. Keep it coming. Let's get a couple of places there. That's one thing about iRacing. Even though I actually drove a Fastest clean race. Two guys having crashes in front of me, which then hit me. Incident in turn one. Looks like it's Muller. I will take a seventh place out of that, I would say. Good day work. Yellow flag, watch out. P7, that's it. We're done. Lucky there, mate. Yeah, that Marco was all over the place in front of you. To be honest, he has some crazy lag going on as well. well that was an interesting race, <laughs> uh, to say the least. Uh, I finished in seventh place, started twelfth, come out with thirty-nine I racing points. Um, unfortunately, eight incident points, which were nothing to do with the way I drove. Um, unfortunately, I was taken out. I was taken out. I was punted off at the hairpin by Mr. Rodriguez, um, who was quick but couldn't race. Not good racecraft, I have to say. He didn't have. Um, he was the quickest man in the field, but that's his problem for not driving very well. Um, he started 16th place. Um, and then avoiding the accident at the end there between Marco and I think it was not sure it was actually but it ruined his race on that last lap though so I had to skip by them but they tapped me um, on the way past which is annoying I wish I could do about that um, but yeah that's the way I racing works it goes you can't have that so there we go finished quite well the top highest split of racing high competitive one I mean I had the pace has been more consistent um, and it was uh, felt quite good about that one. It's better than the first race this evening. Um, so yeah, seventh place in a competitive top quality split. Apart from a few questionable drives from other people, Mr. Rodriguez. I see you. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Um, it's been a pleasure as always. Um, I will put this up, put these two up onto YouTube over the next two days. I want to be tomorrow night, which is Friday, and want to be for Saturday night on YouTube. If you want to go back and watch it in higher quality 1440p is what I will be uploading in for what I record racing um, not in YouTube or Facebook live streams only 720p um, but yeah thanks for watching again guys and I, I will see you all very very soon <laughs>